Okay, so I'm gonna be showing you how to make the value scales, and your goal is to at least mix seven of them, okay? Seven, like seven different ones, like this. Uh, and uh, you have, you're gonna be making one color at a time. When you mix the one color, you shouldn't just do it in one area. Try to utilize that color all over the place. I mean, if you have three different colors, you're gonna be fine, all right? You don't need to mix a lot, a lot of those, uh, a lot of colors. So anyway, in this case, I'm choosing to uh, mix uh, purple. Uh, you may mix the purple with any other color, just the way you guys learned about color mixing you, is the same thing here. The same thing that you did with the color pencils is the same thing with the paint. So you wanna have a, 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 a different type of purple, then you mix this with whatever. You mix it with red, if you want it more reddish, you mix it with blue, if you want it more bluish, right? Like, like a uh, purple blue, a purple red. Honestly, you can pretty much mix any color. And that can happen right here. Uh, right now, I'm just gonna use the, uh, the, pur the purple color. So anyway, you're gonna put seven different uh, whites, right, here, like that. And then you're going to uh, grab the brush about th this size right here, which is a medium, it's about a number four. Um, and you're going to basically put the paint in there about that much, and then you're going to mix it on the first, the first one, okay, like this. Um, and do you notice how the color got a little bit purple right there? So that is going to be, this is going to be one of the value scales, all right? And what I'm going to do, I'm going to put it on this paper. You, you're going to need to put it down on a, on a piece of paper because you want to be able to compare it, okay? So there you have it. That'll be one. How much paint are we going to put on the second one? Well, a little bit more, right? So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, kind of remove as much of the white paint from this one right here, so that it's uh, so it's kind of clean. Okay, removes a lot of that white, and then I'm gonna go ahead and go once like this, put it in there, and then twice. So I'm guessing that if I do this twice this value scale it's gonna be a little bit darker okay uh how do you know because when we put the color over here you're gonna be able to see a little bit of a difference so let's see if that's the case i can kind of see it already can you guys see it already here it's a little bit a little bit but i don't think it's enough let's see I don't know, what do you guys think? Maybe a tiny bit more, right? Just so that it's a little bit more pronounced. So I'm gonna go ahead, go ahead and grab a little bit more paint and I'm going to mix it again. But you gotta mix it really well, okay? Don't just do a little bit. Make sure you, you, you mix it really well. Now, there you go, guys, I can see it. I don't even need to put it here because I can see already that it's a little bit darker. So I'm gonna come here and put it here and guess what, it is, it is a little bit a little bit darker so I'll just take this uh, as my second one and so you're gonna be doing the same thing right I'm cleaning it up I'm gonna go here I'm gonna put one two three now I'm not going to assume that because I put three times here I'm, I'm gonna put here four times uh, I don't want to go over. I don't want I don't want it to be too dark or too much of a of a shift. Okay, so I'm mixing it up. You you guys, that's nice, huh? See that? Cool. Yeah, Lighten it all. Nice, nice. Okay, so let's go do the other one. I'm gonna leave this like this. I'm gonna go ahead and do it again. And you notice, guys, I'm kind of, I'm kind of counting, but I, I don't know if you can see, but sometimes I'm grabbing more color. Like right here, I'm doing twice, three times, 
and I'm kind of grabbing a little bit more. I'm not, also, these are not the same amount of white. So you gotta use your judgment when you are mixing the colors. Um, and so mix them up. I can kind of see that it's a little bit darker, but I, I'm just gonna go ahead and put a little bit more here. So I know you're investing more time doing this, okay? But uh, remember that you're gonna be painting about one third, okay? See that? A little bit, a little bit darker. I'm gonna grab a little bit more. So that's basically how it is. I rather not, I rather for the color not to be too contrasty. And I'll, I'll do one in a second just to show you what I'm talking about. Okay, so you see the difference? It's getting darker and darker. So I'm gonna go, so hopefully by the time you get to the, uh, to the seventh one, your color is gonna be, <clears throat> it's gonna be darker. Okay, mix more, get some more. And you can even, if you want to use your just your eyes here in this case, where you're just looking back and forth to see that it's getting a little bit darker, that, that's another way to see it again. Like right now, it looks like it's the same. Or is it darker? A little bit darker. I'm going to put a little bit more in there. So even then, um, everybody's going to have even everybody's gonna have a different kind of a value scale and it doesn't really matter. Some, some of you are gonna have these really light. Some of you are gonna have them very con contrasty. Uh, you can go back if you want. Uh, you can go back and, uh, and make him more contrasty, right? No. All right. Oh, no. That's it. No. 